is the 15th day of my challenge and so far I have been miserable. <laughs> I am so sorry. I was imagining myself to be all like romantic, waking up early, brew myself a cup of coffee and all that stuff, you know, but at the end of the day, no, it was miserable. So the first weekend, I woke up at uh, 6, right? And I've never been waking up this early before. I never had a full day to myself because I always wake up past 12. And I panicked. I'm like, okay, of all the things I could do now, what am I supposed to do? So I consciously, consciously made a decision to go back to sleep because of all the things I could choose to do, sleeping is the best. So... Technically, I didn't feel fail the challenge that day, but realistically, come on, I went back to sleep. One day, I went to sleep at 3.30 in the morning, and I have work at 9 the next day. So now I'm like, well, you know, I gotta sleep at least 6 hours, so... Excuses, excuses, excuses. If I really wanted to do the challenge, I would have waking up at 6 regardless, but I didn't, so... That day I ended up waking up at 8.30 and and another thing is, it's this is something that pissed me off so much is whenever I wake up at 6, doesn't matter how much coffee I drink, doesn't matter how much energy drink I drink, doesn't matter if I do exercise or not I get so sleepy at around 6 p.m. and that I have to nap, I just have to nap, there is no other way, I just gotta, I just gotta sleep so basically I woke up early but the hours uh, that I didn't sleep were shifted to in the afternoon. So in the end, I didn't have any more waking hours for me to be actually more productive. And, and uh, when I do wake up and do all the things, I ended up spending so much time on social media. Like, I would be watching YouTube videos and I'm not doing anything actually productive. Although I did finish a book, I did wrote my journal. So, okay, I guess... Overall, I have been doing stuff. I have been doing stuff. I just haven't been as productive as I thought I would be if I wake up every day at 6 and have all these extra hours every day. Um, however, I, I am not giving up on myself. I'm not giving up on this potential lifestyle of waking up early and do stuff. For the past 15 days, I've done more than I would have done in 15 days if I hadn't tried so all in general I will keep pushing myself to wake up early I will keep pushing myself to do more things and I will keep just to go for it okay and my co-worker told me hey listen progress is non-linear so uh, yeah, it's not linear okay I just got zigzag and zigzag and zig 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 zigzag <laughs> And that's my update. Um, so I'll keep doing it and I will update you again in uh, 30 days. I'm moving out of this apartment. So after three years of living here, I have to move out of this place now. Uh, it's going to be a little change, uh, which I think it's a good thing. Change is good. So three years later, I'm going to go to a new apartment, start a new life. Looking forward to the future. I have 10 more days left in this apartment. And uh, after that, it will be a new adventure for me. Oh, 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 oh. Anyway, if you watched all the way until the end, thank you so much for watching. <laughs> thank you so much for watching my video. And uh, I will see you very soon. By the way, aren't these flowers beautiful?